and welcome back to psych to go my name's Elise and I'm here to talk to you about what your music taste might say about your personality so everyone has their favorite musician singer rapper band genre of music that they like to listen to and it actually might say a lot about the type of personality that they have based on the big five personality traits which are extroversion agreeableness conscientiousness neuroticism and openness the type of music that you listen to may put you into one of these five personality traits now obviously everyone has a little bit of each but the type of music you listen to may lean you more towards one of the specific five so if you like happy, upbeat, cheerful music that has a good tempo, something you can listen to when you're doing everyday things like your chores or walking your dog, cleaning, things like that, then you would mostly have the trait of extroversion. Now the trait of extroversion, which sounds a lot like extrovert because obviously it's like the same thing, means you're excitable, you're outgoing, you're social, you're talkative, you're assertive and expressive, and that means you generally like to listen to music like hip-hop, rap, electronic, dance music, things like that. Now, if you usually have intense reactions to music, like new music that you've never heard before, and you really listen to it for how it sounds, and you also like upbeat and more conventional music, like things that you hear on the radio, then you mostly have the trait of agreeableness. The trait of agreeableness is described as being very kind, very cooperative. So when you hear music, especially music that you've never listened to before, you really listen to it for what it's saying, how the melody sounds, because you really want to get the full experience. You really just want to hear it. Now the next personality trait is a little bit different from the rest of them. It's conscientious. A person with this trait is very thoughtful, very goal oriented organized. The type of music they listen to doesn't really correlate to how their personality is going to be. So if that's you, you like what you like and you don't what you don't. Good for you. Now if you like to listen to music that makes you feel a certain type of way, then you might have the trait of neuroticism. Now a person with this trait usually is described as being moody, sometimes irritable, emotional, and they tend to listen to music that makes them feel a specific way. If they want to feel happy, they might listen to a country song or a pop song that's upbeat that they like a lot. Or if they're feeling down, they might listen to a sad soundtrack from a movie. Or if they're feeling very confident, they'll listen to a song that matches their mood. So basically, someone with this trait will listen to something that matches the way they're feeling in that specific moment. And lastly, if you like to listen to music that makes you think, something more complex like classical, jazz, blues, alternative, heavy metal, then you might have the trait of openness. A person with this trait is very insightful, imaginative, they're open to new things, and they have a wide variety of interests. People with this trait like to listen to music that's not always the most conventional or mainstream, something that is more intricate but they're always willing to listen to something new and like all kinds of music. Now when it comes to the music, there is some overlap between each five of the personality traits. Just because you like one type of music more doesn't mean you don't fit into a specific trait more than the other. So you could have a lot of extroversion and openness in your personality and still like to listen to music that makes you sad sometimes. So this is not all set in stone. Most people like different types of music, but the kind of music that you listen to most often or that you like the most, you might realize you fit into one of these specific traits more than the other. So that's it for this video. Thanks for watching. If you liked it, subscribe to Psych2Go for more videos like this one. And if you want to follow me on any of my social media, it'll be linked down below. Yeah, bye.